a shallow hall, a shallow hall, the movie with Jack Black and the Gwyneth Paltrow character. Um, I always wish to see people the way they truly are. In Mexico, most often I was looked upon like I was downsizing <laughs> and it hurt me and um, but then again there I had no option look I, I went out with Coca for a while and Coca was um, well they, they saw us together and they said something like la suerte del fe or the lack of the ugly or and then they said uh, like the beauty and the beast and yes he was unpleasant physically but he was awesome he wasn't the best but he was better than anybody else available there for me and that again available means not that they were not wanting to or free but they and can make such a long list of of of, of young successful tall men in all sorts of branches uh, physically beautiful perhaps and whatnot yet uh, coca had nothing yeah he had an alcohol problem <laughs> he had no car <laughs> no house no money <laughs> not a good upbringing he came from a very low neighborhood named barrio neighborhood and yet he was more appreciative than anybody I have ever met. Appreciative. And yes, he put me in a pedestal, but because I am. <laughs> Not because, see, he wasn't licking my arse. He saw, he knew, he felt, he just did. He wasn't kind of worthy though, but then again, I think he took up his job really well and and showed me what he knew, his country and his people. That he made that, I don't know if that was something mindful or not, but the point is, yeah, he, he taught me by sharing, sharing and sometimes even questioning inside as he talked while he thought, you know, when you talk your mind with a loud voice. So he saw I princess and uh, he whatever that he accepted his fate and so for a few months we, we ran around together until then he could could go. Shallow hall, shallow hell, <laughs> shallow hell. In that movie, I like that movie. It's um especially because Gwyneth Paltrow is one of maybe one of my favorite modern actresses since she's so sweet and she never expect anything bad because she's so nice yet when the lady goes in the car the the, you know, the model type kind of was it nurse with them and he saw her like an ugly hag. I was reminded about it yesterday when this new girl came. I mean, I, I don't know if she's so pretty, but in comparison to the old fart and the psycho and the animal and all the others, you know, if you put them next to each other, then that would be like the more beautiful person. And she's like, yeah, it's like an old hag, like shallow hell, horrible. You can't change that. Is unmatching, <laughs> unmatching her ugliness from from you know the appearance. So, I only want to feel good and love, and I want connections. So, whenever a connection was established, I could sit a little bit longer with that person. That was in Mexico.